Hi, this is uh, Tutor Nick P, and this is Music Lyrics Explained 1. And the first one we're going to cover is the Spider-Man theme song. Okay, so I just have important notes on the board, and I'm actually going to read the lyrics and review it as we go along. So, um, let's start. Uh, Spider-Man, Spider-Man, does whatever a spider can. Alright, so when you say... Uh, does whatever a spider can, it means that he has the same skills and the same ability uh, that a spider has. All right, so, I mean, first thing you could look at is, is strength. We know that a, a spider could hold a, up to 170 times their weight. So his strength was supposed to increase that much. Uh, so, like, for example, if he was really just, uh, like, 150 pounds, you know, he was a teenager say he was that much, uh, then he could hold over 25,000 pounds. That's what it would mean. So first is strength. So he has the strength like a spider, because a spider can lift a lot more than their body weight. And, uh, well, of course, we all know about the, uh, the spider web that he can shoot out of his wrist, literally. Um, so, of course, these would be other skills or abilities that a spider has. So... When we say Spider-Man, Spider-Man does whatever a spider can, that's what they're talking about. Uh, another one that they don't often cover in the movies, this idea, but this idea was very true in the comic book. Like if you had read the comic book as a kid and originally the cartoon that was the original, very old cartoon that was on the TV series, we often heard about Spidey Sense that... You know, just like a spider may have a little bit of what they call like a sixth sense of danger. I don't know. I, yeah, and I, I do kind of remember this like as a kid when I read Spider-Man and sometimes I seen a spider and it does seem like a spider does have a little bit. Like if you focus in on a spider, sometimes the, it seems like the spider knows he kind of freezes and he stops. And then if he thinks you're going to go after him, then he will run very, very quickly. But it does seem like he has some sort of a, a sense, this ability. So that's why in the comic book, you often hear about a spidey sense that they don't, we don't, we didn't usually see this in the movies. All right, so let's, let's continue along with the lyrics here. So Spider-Man, Spider-Man does whatever a spider can, spins a web. All right, of course, if we say spin, just if an insect spins... Uh, especially a spider, it makes a thread it produces from its body. So that's what we say. We say that an insect could spin a thread or a web. So spiders definitely spin a web. So, yeah, so spins a web any size, of course, very, very big. We see this. Uh, it is pretty amazing, of course, if this were really possible that somebody could be, you know, get DNA of a spider in them and they could actually shoot webs uh, from their wrist, uh, boy, they would have to eat a lot <laughs> to, to produce that much energy to produce that many webs. Um, but anyway, that, that's what it means. So, uh, spins a web anytime, catches thieves just like flies. Yeah, well, th this is pretty good. This is pretty cool, this idea. That he could, you know, um, of course he's supposed to be like a spider, so it's a spider web. Catches thieves just like flies. Very often he would put a web, a spider web, around especially regular criminals, like regular burglars or something like that. Uh, of course in the comic books he usually fights super villains too. So, but, uh, but anyway, that's what I mean. So catches thieves just like flies. Look out, here comes the Spider-Man. Right, that's how the song goes. Um, yes. Is he strong? Is he strong? Is he powerful? Well, we kind of covered that already because he's supposed to have the ability of a spider. Is he strong? Listen, bud. All right. This was part of the lyrics. Uh, but, uh, bud, as we say, bud is actually short for buddy. Um, okay. So bud short for buddy. Often used when talking to a man you do not know, usually in an annoyed way. It's, it's not always very polite. Like sometimes you say, Hey buddy, that's my seat. Hey, Hey buddy, can you move? Uh, kind of like that. It, it's not really offensive, but it sounds like you might be a little annoyed at someone. And they, we usually use it with a man. But it's part of the song. It's kind of cool. It goes in with the lyrics. Uh, listen, bud. Uh, he's got radioactive blood. Well, of course. Uh, if you've 
watched Spider-Man movies or you've seen the, uh, you know, you read the original comic book, you know, that's the origin of Spider-Man. He gets bitten by a radioactive spider, and that's how he uh, eventually gets to have the powers of, like, a spider mixed in with him. So he's got radioactive blood. Can he swing from a thread? All right, well, just like we said here, with a spinning web, it's a thread. A thread is like a long piece of something, especially a fiber, like something you make a material out of. So, uh, yeah, so he could spin a web. So, uh, can he swing from a thread? Take a look overhead. So, hey there, there goes the Spider-Man. All right, that's exactly how they use it. Uh, and then it goes into another chorus. Uh, in the chill of night at the scene of a crime. So here, of course, if we say chill in this sense, uh, chill has, could have two meanings that both could apply here. You could have chill meaning a feeling of fear. You know, maybe it is scary being out in the middle of the night. Or it could be a feeling of cold. We do know the temperature actually does go down, uh, you know, after midnight or late at night. So that's what they say. So in the chill of night at the scene of a crime, like a streak of light, he arrives just in time. All right, so if we say a streak, a streak here is a line of something that is different in color. I remember when I used to watch the old uh, cartoon, they actually almost had like a spotlight come down, like a police spotlight. So that would be like a streak of light. But of course, you could have other streaks. So we often see, you know, women might have a streak in their hair for a special style or a design. So this is what we mean by streak. So... Uh, in the chill of night at the scene of a crime, like a streak of light, he arrives just in time. Spider-Man, Spider-Man. And then, of course, they, they repeat the other chorus again, you know, does whatever a spider can. Um, yes, arrives just in time. Uh, he arrives just in time. Spider-Man, Spider-Man, friendly neighborhood Spider-Man. Uh, wealth and fame, he's ignored. Action is his reward. All right, so if you say wealth and fame, uh, he's ignored. Basically, it's, it's, it's showing that Spider-Man's not doing this for the money. He's not doing this to become famous. Uh, he's not actually making money from it. He's just doing it out of his sense of morality. Remember, uh, even in the first movie, they kind of had that line, uh, you know, uh, that remember his Uncle Ben supposedly told him. You know, uh, with uh, with great strength comes great responsibility. So he's actually doing it out of his sense of responsibility. So he's he's not doing it for fame. He's not doing it for wealth. So that's how it goes, basically. Friendly neighborhood Spider-Man, wealth and fame, he's ignored. I think means he has ignored it. He's ignoring wealth and fame. That's not what he's about. That's not what he's going for. Uh, action is his reward. Uh, well, maybe, maybe accomplishment of feeling like you're doing the right thing. Action is his reward. To him, life is a great big bang up. All right, um, bang up. Yeah, this is. I think it's a little bit. It was. It was more commonly used. I think in the '60s and '70s. Uh, a, a bang up is an act of doing physical damage. You know, because obviously he's got to fight. So life is a great big bang up. Whenever there's a hang up. All right, a hang up. Hang up. I think was. Uh, kind of a common term also around the 60s and 70s when this song was originally written. Uh, if someone has a hang-up, uh, he or she has a feeling of anxiety or fear of something. All right, so that's what they mean by that. Uh, to him, life is a great big bang-up. Whenever there's a hang-up, you'll find the Spider-Man. You know, that's, that's pretty much the way it goes. Uh, actually, I, I think it's kind of a cool... Uh, uh, theme song for a superhero. One of the best uh, I've actually heard. So, anyway, I hope you got it. I hope it's clear. Uh, I hope it was enjoyable for you. Thank you for your time. Bye-bye.